Fear is the knowledge that every good thing comes to an end. Hope is the attempt to break free of that certainty. Humans spent most of their lives going from the first emotion to the other. But what they fail to realize is that life is never perfect or completely horrible. It usually falls into a dull and unremarkable middle ground. What I've come to find out about humans is that they all share some kind of weird health complication. An allergy to boredom. Most sapient species in the galaxy have understood that boredom and happiness are the same emotion, but humans are yet to make that discovery, all because of hopes and fears. Hope that things could be better, and fear that they could be worse. Take Teddy for an example. He is not really happy. Half his day is spent pondering the hope that one day Milo will come back to him and they live a long and happy life. The other is spent dreading his fear that he'll die alone. Teddy spends so much time poisoning his mind with hopes and fears that he doesn't see what's really surrounding him. Birds chirping in pleasantly monotonous ways. A job that once filled his heart with dreams and now just puts food on the table. Friends who he can share loves with, but who will eventually leave to experience their own lives. And a setting sun that will rise again and set again. Basically a perfect recipe for boredom. A perfect recipe for happiness. I'm so bored. Do you wanna get wrecked tonight? Hell yeah! gestures and never-ending passion. Love is about giving up. Giving up the hope that they'll ever love you the same way you always wanted to be loved. And giving up the fear that you are not enough. Love is about folding socks with a smile, about making two coffees every morning so at least the cup doesn't feel lonely. About turning the heater up anyway even though you hate the warmth. About listening fully to that one story as if you heard it for the first time. And about doing all of those things for yourself and yourself only. All the little things that feel like favors become selfish once done for the one you love. You do it even if they didn't ask, especially if they didn't ask. Now, Teddy wishes he could be bored with Milo one last time. And by dreaming so, he prevents himself from being bored right now. <laughs> 